Guys, if you want cheap and reliable NBA 2K20 MT, go to Safe NBA MT for fast delivery and use code WITNESS for a 5% discount. If you're looking to buy a stacked NBA 2K account with max badges and more, visit SportsTMB.com. Click the first link in the description to get your account today. Yo, what's going on guys? Witness 2K back on NBA 2K20. In this video, we're going to be doing like a God Squad update type video. We're going to be selling some things, moving some things around because I really, really, really want that Pink Diamond Mellow on my, not Pink Diamond, Galaxy Opal Mellow on my squad. He is such a beast. So we're going to have to try and figure something out. Make sure you guys drop a like right now and subscribe to the channel if you are new. We have just under 80k MT Mellow selling for like over 400k. So we're going to need about half a million. I honestly, I don't even really know how I'm going to get there. Going to be selling some cards. Uh, going to be quick selling some shoes and things like that. Maybe as a last resort, we'll open up some packs. Um, these three cards right here, I really want to keep. I would sell Ben Simmons, but I don't know what the Prime Series 2 collection reward is going to be. You know, so I don't know if I'm going to need to keep him or not. So I'm going to hang on to him for now. Um, or I, I guess I could sell him and buy and buy him back. Not Evo, maybe get some MT that way. Definitely want to keep these two cards right here. I've sold my Pink Diamond Bosch. A lot of you did not agree with the fact that I had Pink Diamond Bosch on the squad because he has no clams. I get that. So I'm going to send him to the. I've sent him to the auction. I'll be selling him shortly. I want to keep my Giannis, I want to keep my PG, my Rudy Gay, and I would like to keep Bam as well. He's not that expensive to sell. So, first things first, I'm going to go through, send some things to the auction, quick sell some shoes, and we'll see how much MT we got after that. So, I went ahead and sold everything, guys, and we've only, we've got, we got over 200k, which is pretty good, but we're going to have to dive into these packs right now. I'm going to open up two 10 boxes and save the rest of the VC for another video, but... We're pretty much going to need an Opal pool, to be honest. We get an Amethyst pool. We'll be able to make a decent amount just from selling things, like quick selling us things like Amethyst, or I'll send my send them to the auction and sell them. They have like no value. The pink diamonds don't even have that much value. Like you can get them. I think they're about 40, 50k for the pink diamonds, so they're nothing crazy. So I did open packs when content first came out. We got one pink diamond pool. That was it. So. Hopefully, 2K can sort of redeem themselves with this sort of second dosage of packs. Get back to back at the same freaking player right there. Uh, at least, if, if we can't pull an Opal, can I get like a ton of pink diamonds? Man, these animations go for so long and they're kind of annoying to be honest. At least we don't get the same player. I can't remember who the players are in this. This is Eric, I'm pretty sure. Um, so, we'll be able to quick sell those for a thousand each, but I'm pretty sure you can sell them for like one point. Four, maybe, so it ain't really that worth it. We get a ruby, at least the animation's not a long animation. Another freaking amethyst. Final few packs. Okay, pink diamond pool. That's better, because we'll be able to make some MT. Like I said, they're not that expensive, the best of my knowledge anyway. I, rockets, I don't even know who this is, but um, let me Ralph Sampson, actually. He may actually have some value. That's solid, I hope he sells for over 100K. But that's like the best pink diamond, I'm pretty sure, in this set. Um, so we'll take that. Can we get an opal? Another amethyst man. These animations are so annoying. Final pack in this 10 box. It's going to be a ruby. We did get a pink diamond, but we're going to open up one more box. What we might do is send, send Ralph to the auctions right now. Hopefully he's over 100k. So we're going to send four hours. All right, so he's kind of cheap as well. So we can sell our Ralph. I'll sell mine for 65K, which is pretty good. You know, it's it's we're still not that close to Mellow, to be honest, but it's a step in the right direction. Let's go with 65. He should sell pretty quick. And we'll open up one more box now. Final box, can we get an Opal Pool or like three pink diamonds to make the MT for Mellow? I'd rather, obviously, the Opal Pool. When we started off with a ruby, I'll be able to sell that silver for a little bit. If we get a diamond, the diamonds are selling for about 5k each roughly. We're going to get Jay Williams. I pulled this man like five times or something in my actual pack opening video. Pulled him so many times. That's right, they were selling for a couple of k as well. If I can at least, if I don't get an opal man, if I could at the minimum get a pink diamond, 
so I don't feel totally bad. Another ruby. Come on, I'd rather a ruby over an amethyst, to be honest. Just because of how long the animation is. Okay, maybe not. Give me something that's worth something. Another ruby. I. It just takes one pack. Show me an opal. Opal. Another ruby. Two more packs. Come on, clutch, clutch it. We get a diamond. It's a contract that'll sell for more than a diamond player, so that's actually better. And we get an amethyst to wrap it up. So we're gonna make some more MT, but. Bro, not much, not much more to be honest. So we sold our pink diamond rail, but we're still not close to that mellow. We're still under 300K. But what I think I'm gonna have to do is put a hold on this video, record a prize pack pack opening video, make whatever MT I can from that, then come back to this video. I don't know when these videos are coming out. I don't know if I've already dropped the prize packs or if it's coming later, but I think once I record that, make some MT from it, then I think we'll be good. I might even drop the prize pack first. So you guys, that'll sort of, that, that should just help the timeline out a bit. All right guys, so it's the next day right now and seriously man, the plan that I had to make MT seriously went so freaking well. So the plan was to stop recording the first half of this video, make a prize pack pack opening video, post that, whatever I pull from that prize pack, make MT from it. If you didn't see it, go and check it out. It was crazy. We were able to pull this Diamond Giannis out of a free prize pack, which I made 20K from. We were also able to get from the token market a pink Diamond Magic Johnson, who I sold for over like 120K or something like that. We're gonna sell all this now. We got some rubies, not some rubies, some silvers, some heat checks and things like that. And we're gonna have over half a million MT to be able to place a bid on that Galaxy Opal Mellow and add him to the gold squad. I'm pretty sure he's under that half a million mark. So I, I'm feeling good. I think we should be able to get him. I will not be locking in the set. You know, I just, I don't really like locking in sets. And I don't really like locking in sets just because of the fact I can't sell the cards later on. You know, that, that's what sort of sucks. All right, we've got a Mellow right here. This one's got a diamond contract. Look how cheap these ones are going for. I mean, obviously they're gonna get a big boost, but we're gonna, these have diamond contracts, so they're gonna sell for more. I think I'm gonna wait for this one right here, which is gonna be five minutes away, but I think that's the one right there. I don't need diamond contracts because I open packs at the time. I've always got plenty of contracts. I'm not worried about it, but, so I'm gonna go for this one right here. In five minutes time, we'll come back. And we'll place a bit. I really want to win that one though, because if we don't, we'll have to wait another like seven minutes. All right guys, so the price is not a huge difference. I'm gonna wait probably like 10 seconds. This is the mellow I want. I'm hoping people like focus on this one and I can just swoop in and pick up this mellow. Right, we're gonna back out, I'm gonna place a bid. Hopefully we'll get the, we get the first bid so I don't have to place another one. We bid it on it. It should be good. I'm pretty sure we're going to win that one. And we got outbidded. So that's fantastic. We're going to have to try again. I'm going to wait like another couple minutes, I think. I'm going to wait another six freaking minutes now. That's so annoying. The price of Mello seems to be, it's gone back up. I don't know if I should wait for this one. I'm going to place one bid on this one. If I win it, screw it. I'll just, I'll just, I'll just spend half a milli on him. I know I probably could have gotten him for cheaper. We might still get outbidded. I don't know. We actually got outbidded on that. I can't place another bid. Sure, he, he, he can definitely go for cheaper. We'll try this one. Hopefully we can just pick this one up for cheaper, but it's still got a minute and a half to go. All right, we're gonna try this mellow now. I'll spend everything I've got. Everything. Everything for this mellow. I still, why has his price just gone up like that? So I sold some shoes, um, made a couple extra K. We got this mellow counting down right now. I think maybe his price may have calmed down. It had a little bit of a spike there, which is really annoying. But um, we're gonna wait a few seconds and we're gonna try and cop this one. It's got no contracts or anything, but I'm not worried about that. All right, we're gonna place our first bid now and see how we go. If I could just win him for that, that'd be so sweet. Give me, give me, give me him for under half a million. Still not high enough. What is with this card's price right now? All right, guys, we're gonna try this again. I made a little bit more MT. I'm gonna place the bid early to try and distract people away from it or something. Maybe they won't wanna bid on it if it's too high or something. So far, we're winning though. No doubt, we're probably gonna get outbidded, but as long as I can place one more bid after this, 
then maybe we'll be good. If that doesn't work, I might just completely max out the bid on a different one with every penny I got. But if we win this one for 411, bro, I'm gonna be happy as hell. All right, guys, we got the final six seconds. Don't outbid me. Don't you dare outbid me. Yo, that's a dub if we won that. That's for real. A dub if we would just won that. We won it. <laughs> I'm so glad we got outbidded on those half a million ones. I still have a, over 100K in the bank. That is awesome. We might, we may even buy another new card. So we picked up the mellow guys. We're about to build our squad. We've got a blank canvas right here. So make sure you guys do drop a like right now and subscribe to the channel if you are new. We're gonna move it around a little bit. My starting point guard is going to be Giannis. Normally it's Ben Simmons, but I prefer Giannis. I prefer Giannis over Ben Simmons. So we are going to be benching Ben Simmons. The reason I bench him is because yes, I could play him a power forward, but what is the point of that in my opinion? I don't understand that. If you're gonna have cards like these, you gotta run them a point guard or they're just not, they wouldn't be worth spending the amount of MT you spend on them. Shooting guard, you know, we've got to run T-Mac, of course. Small forward, I don't know who to start at a KD or Melo. I think I'm going to start Melo because he's new for now. I'm a big Kevin, Kevin Durant fan, but Melo, he just, I think he's the better card. And we're actually going to be benching Kevin Durant as my backup power forward. Now, I could start him, I know, but these two dudes right here being able to shoot, Giannis being as athletic as he is able to get inside, I, I just don't need all that offense on the team. I'm just trying to spread the talent as much as I can. So I've always got really good cards on the team. So I am trying to go 12 and 0. Power forward I'm going to run is Rudy Gay. You know, he, I mean, his, what's his height? He's not huge, but I mean, he is 6 foot 8. These two dudes are the same, same height. Um, but yeah, I want to run him at the power forward. The center is going to be, of course, Bam. That is the starting lineup at the moment. I know it's probably looked better before, but I think it's smarter doing what I'm doing. My backup shooting guard is gonna to go to Rex Chapman. He's not the best card, but he's actually a really good sniper and it saves me buying another another shooting guard, to be honest. Small forward is, of course, gonna to go to PG. And center, I have been running Aaron Baines, but you know, we can definitely switch that up. You know, we got, we got over 100K MT to spend. So we might go to the auction and see what else we could buy for that amount. I'm tossing up between Greg Oden and Ralph Sampson. I think I'm gonna go Ralph. He's probably taller, right? He's seven foot four. Greg Oden is, he's seven foot. I think Ralph's the move. So we got a Ralph 65 neat. Is as cheap as we're gonna be able to pick him up. Never mind, we're gonna get him for an extra 100 MT. I'm okay, I can spare that. Can we win that one? I really wish Jimmer was cheap. I don't know what he's selling for. He was super cheap when he first came out in packs. If we can get him for under, oh, we can pick him up. That's perfect. Please, please, please. God damn it. Yo, we nearly picked one up for freaking 25K. That would have been a huge dub. That would have been absolutely massive. We just missed out on that snipe. That sucks. But we still got him for 30. It's not, I know it's only a few K, but obviously every little bit of MT counts. We're gonna have two new pink diamonds adding both campus legends. We're gonna add three of the campus legend players to our, to our team now. So we're gonna replace our Aaron Baines for Ralph, replace Ek, uh, Rex for Jimmer. Team is looking much better. This is definitely the best we've had the team. I may start Ralph. I just haven't used him yet. I know I like Bam, so, you know, we'll keep it like this for now. I've got to play some games, you know, got to try and go 12 and 0, but I'm loving how the team is looking, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I hope you guys are on board with how the squad is looking. Make sure you drop a like right now and subscribe to the channel if you are new with that notification bell turned on. So close to 50K subs, I'm so hyped. Um, if you have any suggestions for me, definitely put them down below. But like I said, guys, that's going to wrap up this video, and I hope you all enjoyed it. Shout out to the video goes to Hamish Freak. Shout out to you, bro, for commenting. I really do appreciate you. But I'll catch you on the next upload, guys. It's been witnessed. <laughs>